Hello? Mom? Hey, is, is everything okay at your end, or is the seafood and southern hospitality getting to you? Uh, no, actually, uh, Dad's not here. He must have left early. Um, listen, actually, this is this is good that you called, because, um, I'm, uh, I, I, I've got this, this, this project in school I'm doing in, uh, in English class. Uh, we're studying poetry, yeah, romantic poetry, um, and Keats, and, uh, Mr. Murdy wants, uh, uh, a thousand words on, um, romantic poetry and Keats, so, um, since I'm not real experienced in that field, uh, I thought I'd, I'd, I'd just ask you, um, the first time you met Dad, I mean, the, the very first time, what, what was it like, what, I mean, was it like Romeo and Juliet, or Laurel and Hardy, or Tyson and Holyfield, I mean, really, love at first sight, come on, does that really happen, though, I mean, no, no second thoughts, no, no fears, not ever, no, mom, me, no, I'm not looking for a girlfriend, <laughs> I'm, this is research, so that's all it is. Anyway, look, um, something's burning on the stove here, so and I gotta get to class, so um, I'll talk to you later, okay? All right, I, I love you. Bye. Hey, what, what are you doing home, Dad? That's funny. I was about to ask you the same thing. out of a math test and I just thought I'd come home and catch up on my sleep. Really? Yeah. I remember the days when a guy could catch up on his sleep in class. Excuse me. Well, I didn't place out on a math test and I've got to, I've got to avoid the tax man today, get my forms all done and I can't find my calculator and I can't even balance a check. Oh, oh here it is. What, did you put it here? No. Oh, all right. Uh, I left a message for you last night because I got home late. Did oh, you get it? Yeah, I'm sorry. I, I meant to call, but I'm, I'm doing this, uh, this big research project, and I just crashed when I got home. Research? Yeah. Man, you're working too hard. It's called school, Dad. Oh. History, actually. I went to the uh, newspaper morgue and uh, checked out some microfilm from the 80s. The 80s? Ooh. Jurassic era. Well, if you read anything about me, it is true I was mayor of Port Chuckles, yeah. briefly, but everything else is lies. Well, there was actually some pretty complimentary hero stuff, Dad. Oh, that was always a matter of opinion. There was also some bad stuff about Nicholas's father. Stavros. Well, there should have been. A lower-life scum never graced a morgue slab. Yeah, like what he did to Mom. Right. Dad, nobody, nobody knows about that, right? Just the people involved. And the Cassidines would spin it their own way if they could. Make everybody villains except them. I'm telling you, Dad, Nicholas, he, he's good. I mean, he, he, he'll spin anything into a lie. Anything. You're wound up pretty tight, cowboy. What's up? Something you need to tell me? No. Just more of the same, you know? Lizzie? I'm looking for the truth. It's not even about revenge anymore, Dad. I'm just trying to find the truth. Well, maybe you'll find it. Or maybe it'll find you. I got a class to get to. Yeah. I'll see you later. Okay? Yeah. Yeah. I'll be at the club a little late. Don't work too hard. Mr. Baldwin? 
Yeah. No, I'm Lucky Spencer. Yeah, I know who you are, Lucky. I'd like to speak to you for a moment. This is a bad time. If this is, you can pick another. Sit down. Would you like something? No. No, thanks. Okay. Isn't this a school day? Yeah. I'm doing some independent study. Well, independent, I believe. What are you studying? I'm checking out some information. There's a lot I already know. About what? The night my mother was raped. She was found in the park, but she... She didn't say rapist's name. That's right. Not even to you? I mean, you were married to her then. Well, you know, you can be married to somebody and not know everything about them. I, um, didn't understand that at the time, but I do now. Where is this coming from? From me. Yes. I figured that. You didn't just, uh, run into me here. You, you tracked me down, didn't you, Lucky? Yeah. I called your office. They said you were meeting somebody here at the Outbacks. Well, you're very resourceful. Now, I... I didn't ask how. I asked why. Because I have as much a right to know about my own family as other people do. That's why. Well, yeah, it's, it's clear that you want to know, but... Do you have the right? Well, that's a $64,000 question. I just need a simple yes or no answer. Was it my father? Was he the rapist? You know, if you're looking for a yes or a no, you got the wrong guy here, Lucky. You got the wrong guy. Uh, life? What I learned back then, and what I know now, is that life is complicated. Well, what I'm asking isn't complicated. Did my father rape my mother? You know, you... You got quite a... a lot of your mother in you. You got her eyes. Pretty blue eyes, like your mother. But you got your father's personality. And, you know, uh... If you go looking for dirt out there, it, it's a dirty world, you'll find... Dirt and it'll rub off on you. And I bet this is the advice your father would give you. And maybe you, maybe it's worth something. I don't know. You're afraid of him? Of your father? No. Yeah. I know you're not protecting him. And you must hate him for how my mom chose him over you. I did. Lucky, no, I did you once. still do. That's why you're talking like a fortune cookie. Because you don't have the guts to badmouth my father. You figure if you don't give me any answers, I'll just take it as a yes. Well, it's the wrong answer here, okay? You know, you were right about one thing, all right? At one point, I would like to have stuck Luke in prison for the rest of his life. I would have made anything stick. But, come on, that was a long time ago. I've changed. I haven't got time to play those games. I got kids of my own I got so let me just give you a piece of advice okay don't go poking around in things that happened before you were even born no, I guess I'm gonna have to find my answer somewhere else thanks okay I'm sorry I just have one more question how badly was my mom hurt physically she was fine you know she got a clean bill of health from general hospital but emotionally I don't know. I don't know. I was never privy to that.
October 8th. Subject treated for abrasions, trauma, shock, indications of sexual assault as follows. Police notified. Patient did not identify assailant by name. 